very effective. Okay? The opposite, when he comes in, I move his feet out. Okay? So the way that we do that is, is by using my rope or by focusing on his inside front hoof. So if he gives me two laps of the trot on the outside, I'll take my shoulder past his nose and I'll walk to the opposite rail all the way over here and I'll touch the rail. You might say, why would you do that? Why don't you give him a carrot or a sugar cube or something? Don't hit him in the face. The most comfortable I can make this horse is if I get as far away from him as I possibly can. So because we're in an 18 meter round pen, the furthest I could get is 18 meters away. So if he just does something correctly, I move 18 meters away. Okay? So we'll try this again. Working in the same direction, so that I'm controlling his feet, trying to keep him within one meter of the rail. I would like him to do two laps at the trot, and if he does, my shoulder goes past his nose, and I walk away from the horse. Now, it's very important that when you're walking away from the horse, that you don't turn around and look at the horse, okay? Earlier, we did a workshop with eight students and their horses, and some of the students, and a lot of students will do this, turn and look at the horse. And let me show you why you don't do that. If the horse does something correctly, and you're a good leader, you reward the horse by turning, and then you walk about this far and go, can you see the horse's face? Huh? If I'm not sure about the horse, the horse is going to be unsure about me. Okay? He looks very concerned. He's like, why did he stop? Why is he looking at me? So when you reward the horse, it's important that you just walk away and everything's okay. I told the students earlier, I've worked with over 4,000 horses. I have never had one horse, after the reward, come up behind me and scare me or bite me or kick me or any of those things, okay? Now, I have gotten in the... Uh, yeah. They will come behind you, and they'll come very close sometimes, right in your ear, but never aggressively, okay? If you engage a horse this way, you can get into a fight with the horse. But if you reward the horse properly, you shouldn't have a problem.